Well, happy uh, July 5th, everybody. Hope everyone's having a great day and survived the 4th okay, huh? Really haven't done anything uh, here today except working on some new projects. So just kind of seeing what's going on and working on this new, this new uh, online studio. So just trying to see what's going on and if we uh, have anything going on to, uh, to talk about. I'm going to pop on Facebook here and to see if this is showing up, and we'll see if uh, if we're on, and it looks like I'm there. All right, I got two, I got a couple people watching, so uh, did everybody have a good fourth? Okay, now I've got closed captioning going on, and it's not, it's not reading redneck, apparently. <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. So now I got to figure out how to take the closed captioning off and go from there. So I've got that there set, and I've got the streaming set. Boy, don't you love technology? I just love technology. It's amazing. Uh, let's see, who's all out there? Nate, how you doing? Good morning, Don. It's actually in the afternoon, Don. It's not good morning, buddy, but thank you. Fourth was good. Hope you had a good one. Matt, I did. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Now, how do I get the closed captioning off? I got that. Use echo cancelization. I got that. Mike. Don't you love don't you love all this stuff? Just just had fun with the granddaughter. Hope your fourth was a good one. Richard, that's awesome, man. I had a good one, just Jenny and Rave and I, and we watched some fireworks, and I did the show in St. Louis uh, last night, so it wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad at all, actually. So Now I just got to figure out what, uh, good morning, or good afternoon, Mason. How you doing, buddy? Now Don's got me saying good morning. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I got to figure out how to take the closed captioning off. So it's not showing up on on uh, the screen on Facebook. See, I'm not seeing it on the studio, but I'm seeing it on when I look on the Facebook Live. I'm seeing I'm seeing closed captioning. So anyway, hey, we got some uh, just real quick. Well, I got a few of you on here. We're gonna we're gonna be working. Actually, I'm, I was up till three last night working on this. We're gonna have a new way for you to listen to outdoor radio that's never been done before. If I can get this done. What is that? Uh, I have no idea what that is. Hmm. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to do some more research on this. It's probably gonna take me a few. It's probably gonna take me a little bit to get it to get it formatted and stuff. But I've already talked to several of my friends that have outdoor programming, and they really like the concept. So uh, this will be in addition to the radio shows that I'm doing in Iowa and, and down back down on St. Louis. So this will be a Okay, here makes no sense. <laughs> Thanks, Ned. Appreciate that. Uh, it just, uh, it's going to be a way for you to go listen to something and listen to any of the outdoor programming you'd ever want to listen to without having to go search for it. So um, I'm excited about that, and uh, hopefully we'll have uh, we'll have some stuff going on there. Yeah, I think I'm, I think I'm good. I don't think I have any. Anything to worry about there, Ned, but thank you. How you doing, Roger? How's things in New York, man? You doing well? I hope so. All right. Uh, really nothing else going on. Just kind of working on this stuff here and making sure that the, the studio screens and everything looks good. And it looks like everything is showing up on Facebook on, on when I go to the timeline there. So we should be good, huh? We should be good. So... Anyway, uh, thanks for everything. I really, well, that's cool, Raj. Thank you. Uh, I'm glad you guys had fun. Thanks for everything out there. Appreciate the support on the radio programs. Thank you so much for following Respect the Game TV. Thanks, Aaron. I appreciate that. Uh, just, we'll be doing this live every week on the radio program. And uh, so when you're watching Facebook, I'll be able to scroll information down there if I got something that you guys need to know about or. If we got something special, and I if I can get this fly off of me, 
I tell you, it's like being in the outdoors indoors, right? But uh, it, it, this, I think this is going to be a really good way to uh, get a lot of information out there. Oh, yeah, Cubs, yeah. Hey, if you uh, have not got your tickets for the Iowa Cubs game, it's this Saturday coming up. The first 500 people that uh, come out there will get a work sharp sharpening tool like I've got in my hot little hand. This is really neat. You can uh, see the sharpener right there. It's got a it's got a steel sharpener and then it's got a ceramic edge uh, on there too. I'm probably not showing it right it's for the camera, but uh, the and you the little bits inside there. See the little bits right there. You can customize those and put stars or Allens or or whatever you want to do. But uh, I want to thank uh, my friends at uh, Faith, at WorkSharp, Kyle and Josh and everybody for uh, sending those first 500 folks through the gates is going to get that. And then when everybody gets ready to leave, uh, we got a whole bunch of yeah that was that was sad Aaron. We got a bunch of uh, Sportsman's Warehouse. I think we got 500 Sportsman's Warehouse hats free to give away when you're leaving the game. Now, that's just when you come in and leave. During the game, we're going to be giving away a brand new Elite hunting bow, which is around 1000 bucks. Uh, I think we'll give that away in the 7th or 8th inning. I've got a three or $400 Grizzly cooler to give away and a $250 gift card to Sportsman's Warehouse. So you'll be able to register that. I'll be set up right by the gate uh, with a, an outdoors Dan table. And uh, you can come by and say hi. And then I've got some Kershaw Knives swag uh, to give you when you sign up while supplies last. So it's going to be a fun deal. Uh, it's a salute to the outdoors on Saturday at Principal Park. And uh, it's whatever hand you are, Aaron. I'm going to have to order it. So it's a brand new bow, bud. So if it's whoever wins, it's, it's going to fit them. It's a custom bow. So it's uh, left or right, whatever you need. So I'm excited about that, and it's going to be a lot of fun. And uh, the DNR, the Iowa DNR, it's going to be there to talk with you, and they'll have some stuff set up. And it should be a fun event. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, and then uh, we got some other stuff coming up here pretty soon too. So, all righty. Well, thank you, Eric. I appreciate that. Yeah, it's going to be fun. I wish Larry Mack and uh, the guys from Respect the Game was going to be there with me, but they're going to be in Ohio at the Pure Whitetail Bash. That's a that's another party in itself in Ohio. That's that's an amazing thing. I'll have, I'm hopefully next year I'll get a chance to go check that out. But anyway, all right. Hey Rocco, what are you doing, buddy? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well, taking care of that family out there in Pennsylvania, sitting on Mountain Man and everybody. Somebody needs to. Somebody needs to sit on those guys. So. All right, listen, you all be good, and uh, I will check in with you uh, uh, sometime this week. I will, and other than that, we'll uh, be doing the show live uh, from the press box at Principal Park uh, Saturday morning, and then I'll have a chance for you to come out to the, to the, to the park. Uh, I'll probably have 10 pairs of tickets to give away. I'll check in. I've got to check in with Andrew and the Cubs and everybody just to make sure what we haven't given away yet on the station, but... Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Saturday is going to be a fun day. And then Saturday night, I will see you at the park. And uh, Cubby Bear and I and uh, the Cubs will be there to, to visit with you. James, you got your tickets already? That's awesome. I'll look forward to seeing you. Hey, all the tickets that we gave away are right behind home plate. So great seats. That's awesome, huh? Great seats. Can't beat that. All righty. You guys be good. Enjoy your time off. And uh, hopefully we'll get some fishing in this week, too. Uh, like been a, a couple weeks since I've been out fishing so feels like forever but it's only been a week or two so all right you all be good and I will see you later god bless you thanks sir hey Carrie how you doing man see y'all later uh, here on Facebook and uh, this weekend on the talk to you on the radio and see you at the principal park see you everybody